This video is going to show how to install brackets and the brackets extensions. Not all of them actually, just some and how you would do it. So if you go to brackets.io, that's where you can get brackets. Now if you're on a Mac, um, and this by the way should show you um, the right one. If you're on a Mac, it should show you the Mac link. If you're on a PC, it would show you the PC link. Um, so I'm just going to click and install this one and um, I'm just going to do it in a folder I have for class. So you can actually install it in uh, different locations. It doesn't have to be in the applications folder. Um, and then you would extract it. In Windows it's a similar thing. It's a, a self-extracting one that you can do and then load up. So I'm going to actually even quickly go through the install process here. It's pretty quick. All right, now what this says is to drag it to your applications folder, which is normally what you would want to do. Um, I am actually going to um, instead install it right in this class folder that I have. So you can actually drag it to another folder if you like. And you may need to do this in school if you are have to reinstall it in school or whatever want to install it for some reason. So. I'm just showing you sort of this alternate way of doing it, though normally, yes, you would just drag it right into your Applications folder on the Mac. All right, so um, there it is. I'm going to open this up right here. And now what may happen is um, it may say this. It's downloaded from the Internet. Just you want to open it, and you'd click Open. Okay, so normally the window is a lot bigger. I'm going to sort of shrink it down a little bit here. Um, now, this is actually opening up a lot of things that I, I already have. So I'm just going to make um, here a, um, a new folder and just call it um, test. Um, and I'm going to open that one up in brackets. Now, one thing you can do is I'm going to drag this folder down to the brackets app that's now at the bottom. You can't really see that there, but uh, it's going to do that. Um, and so now I'm opening up this folder by itself. Okay, so um, close out this other one. There we have brackets. It's open. Um, it's loaded. Pretty simple. Um, now to see, to get what I'm uh, doing next, uh, I'm going <coughs> to uh, change this up a little bit so I can you can see where I'm at with the file to do the extensions. So now what I'm going to do is under File, go to the Extension Manager. And so it's going to show you what's available. Um, also, what's installed now, it actually remembers what I've done. So even if you install it again, it often will still pick up what you've done. So you can see here there's a few that I've installed already. Um, Beautify is one. Uh, Brackets Git is another one. Emmet is another one, um, and so forth. So the the two that the few that I would say would be um, Brackets Git and Beautify and Emmet. All right, so I'm just going to show you um, how to do a couple of those. Um, we'll do. I'm just going to disable. Um, I sorry, remove. I guess for now, um, Emmet, and show you that one, and close this out. That'll remove it, and then we'll show you how to open that. And it's basically the same process for all of them. Got to wait for it to reload. So some extensions, when you close them out, it's got to um, load back up again. Uh, all right, so sorry. Somehow, occasionally this happens. Uh, let's bring all to the front. Yep, it didn't. It didn't unload properly. So I'm going to quit out of this. So this is actually good to sort of see that this happens sometimes. Um, that you have to, sorry, quit out of it. Uh, here we go. So this is another way if you right click and hold the option uh, key down on a Mac, that's what's called force quit. So I'm, I right clicked, hold the option key down, 
force quit this out here, and now we'll open up brackets again. All right, and we'll show how to add an extension. All right, so it's already there. It's it's it's, it's on. So I type in Emmet. All right, let me get the one I want. Click install. Close. And then I would close this out. So with Emmet, sorry, and sorry this is moving around so much, but there it is. You can see at the top of the window here. Um, Emmet will show now. Not all of them will show here. Um, every time some show different ways for example um, like beautify that's under edit here you can see beautify um, and then there's a few other ones that are in different ways too um, for example if I go to file um, this goes to git settings that's the brackets git extension that shows there um, whether you can see that or not also sometimes now in brackets what you'll find is that um, these show up in the sidebar um, so that's an extract for brackets one. This is the uh, link to the terminal. Um, this is opens and closes the git one. So for those who don't want to remember the, the command for it, this shows me my little git window down there. Um, this is um, another extension that I happen to do that just shows you what functions you have in it. Uh, and, and there's other ones like that. So, oh, and this, by the way, is the extension manager. This is another way to get to the extensions. All right, so that is extensions.